Please disconnect the power and remove the battery before changing an LCD panel. Then remove rubber screw covers from the bezel. Then remove four bezel screws. Go ahead and remove the bezel. Start from the side and gently move around to the other side. Now that the bezel is detached, remove two top frame screws and loosen two bottom frame screws. Turn the laptop sideways and remove three LCD screws, then three more on the other side. Support the screen on the last couple of screws. Carefully put the screen on the keyboard and disconnect the inverter connector. Then lift the clear tape securing the video connector and disconnect the video cable. This is a CCFL screen. It requires an inverter. Your laptop might use LED screen, which does not use an inverter. LED and CCFL screens are not interchangeable. Discard the old panel. Place a cloth or a paper towel on the keyboard if the replacement screen doesn't appear to have any protective film. Put the new screen on the keyboard and reconnect the inverter cable. Then reconnect the video cable. Make sure to align the connectors properly and don't use too much force. Video connectors are very fragile. Lift the screen up, minding the protective film tabs. Align the screen with the frame and remove the protective film. Secure the three LCD screws then three more on the other side. Replace the top two frame screws and tighten the bottom two frame screws. Go ahead and replace the bezel. Align in the bottom and move consistently on both sides to the top, gently snapping the plastic throughout the perimeter of the screen assembly. Replace four bezel screws, then replace the rubber screw covers. Flip the laptop over to make sure the bottom edge is properly snapped in. Then replace the battery and reconnect the power. Put the laptop up. If the startup graphics appear, the screen is properly installed and you're done.